What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna basically tell you how to fix every kind of error you're currently having with Epic Games. So 6 p.m. guys, this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you'll perfectly know what to do in order to fix these kind of issues. Before we start right into the video, I just want you guys to know or let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys, you would support my work on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say, let's get right started. So the first step is gonna be to basically navigate to the very bottom of your screen where you're gonna right click your taskbar and open up your task manager or just simply use the shortcut for that. Navigate to the top left corner, click onto processes and once you clicked on processes, I want you to click one of those random processes, doesn't really matter which one and type in epic games so e if nothing pops up it's good for you if something pops up simply right click and hit end task once you finish with that you should also be able to end the task manager again the next step is going to be to take your epic games launcher on your desktop and if you don't have it there you simply use your windows search function in order to find it so next step is going to be to right click that and go to the very bottom where it says properties Gonna click on that click on the compatibility and simply copy my settings so let's quickly run through it enable run this program compatibility mode 4 select windows 8 disable the disable full screen optimizations as well as enable run this program as an administrator hit apply and okay i would personally recommend to go to the bottom left corner of, after that hit settings and hit update and security download the latest version of windows and do the same thing for a graphics card afterwards restart your pc and you should be able to see this little administrator symbol right on your launcher Afterwards, I want you to double click it and launch your launcher and this will fix your issue. Okay guys, that's it for the video. I hope that I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm going to really be thankful for that. And yeah guys, that's it for the video. I hope that I could actually help you out. See you at the next one and bye.